look at this amazing breakfast. <laughs> breakfast sandwich. I don't know what all the fried things are. Rice. Some kind of like pancake. Last night it tasted to me like it was chickpeas, right? Fruit with yogurt, orange juice, some kind of bean thing, and a dessert. I don't know if I can eat this all. We just arrived to the train station Fez. We're going to Marrakesh and we met our new friend Florence at our react. She's gonna come with us for today. to our Riyadh in Marrakesh and it's absolutely beautiful. That's the entrance and we're actually on the lower level so it goes directly out to the main courtyard which is why we already have the blinds and windows closed but we'll reopen them in a bit. Look how huge this bed is. It looks so comfy and then the washroom is here. Hi guys. The sink the toilet and then look at that shower head so amazing compared to some of the other washrooms we've been in recently and the mosaics and tile work are amazing looks like a good place to stay So as you can see, we had a really, really good dinner um, and now we're actually going to be turning in for the night because we've got a really early start tomorrow. We're getting picked up at 7.30 for our big desert trek. So um, yeah, we're going to turn in, uh, but in the meantime, take care. And keep smiling. Good morning. It is 7.15 and we are about to head outside our Riyadh for the pickup for our desert trip. Today should be much more exciting than yesterday's six and a half hour travel journey from Fez to Marrakesh. Elsie, look. <laughs> These are the roosters that woke Nick up at 6 a.m. This is the Riyadh that we stayed at last night. We had a slight hiccup this morning. We were picked up by the wrong tour group. So now they've dropped us back off at our Riyadh and we're waiting for the correct tour group to now pick us up. Hopefully it's soon.
Kasbah, this Ayn ben Haddad, and this one village about is very old for 11th century. And also that is the place we're shooting the mini movies. Kasbah means just one house with the four towers, that it means Kasbah. The last one, it's not a movie, it's the series Game of Thrones. Different Berber and Arabic. And of the Berber people speak Arabic. The Arabic people is not speak Berber. Why? Because on school we have just Arabic in French. And also for writing the Berber, we write in Berber in the left, we finish on the right. The Arabic is in the richer, we finish on the left. It's different. The middle one, art colors from here. The steam colors, different. The synthetic scarf, that is cost 2 euro and half, 25 gram. The problem, if you to put it in your face, the color says they are the blue.
lunch. We have now arrived in Oar Zazat. Don't really know what's happening. No, no idea, but hopefully it'll be fun. Let's see what happens. Absolutely breathtaking, and they're reminding me of our trip to BC and Alberta this past summer. And it's just breathtaking in a different way, but like nothing I've ever seen before. Absolutely incredible, and a can't miss experience. So unique. our hotel for the night. We've just been dropped off. Dinner is included but we're gonna settle into our room first. So we just checked into the hotel. Um, we got welcomed by a Berber who actually provided us with some lovely tea and some peanuts and some wafers and officially welcomed us into the home which is incredible. Um, we've just been shown our room and this is the courtyard just outside of our room and this is the view. Just Look at that. That is a way to wake up. Um, but yeah, so that's the courtyard, that's the view, that's the sound. And this is our room. And it is so nice. Um, so we've just got like a little dumping bed here. And we've got our own bed here. And so you got this sink, which is extremely ornate. It's got like little detailing with fossils and everything like that, which looks fantastic. Um, and then obviously toilets as per usual, lovely little mirror. Um, but then look at the side of this bad boy. How amazing is this shower? Plenty of room to shave your legs and move around and also not flood the bathroom or the bedroom, which is something that I did in Fez. Exactly. That basin is deep and it's going to work really well. Dinner was so good and we were so hungry that I clearly forgot to film it. But basically we had a Moroccan soup to start and then we all shared some chicken and some mixed beef and different uh, vegetable salads and some rice and potatoes for dinner. I may not have remembered to film dinner, but this is dessert. After a delicious dinner, an amazing first day on our desert tour. We're going to tuck in as we have another early start tomorrow morning. Yep, it's going to be a lot of driving, but then also camel rides and some desert camping. So looking forward to that. In the meantime, take care. And keep smiling.